Hi everybody, it's Miss Carrie from Bridgeville Public Library and South Fayette Township Library and it's time for Homemade and Healthy. And what we're going to be doing today is making a banana uh, hair mask, which is going to be a lot of fun. So now that you know what you'll need, let's get started. So what you'll need to do first is take your banana and you want to half it. All right. All of these ingredients are going to go into the blender. So, um, so I'm just putting mine right away in the blender. What I'm going to do with the other half is, um, I actually use bananas every day in my shakes, um, that I make in the morning. So I'm just going to put it in a plastic bag and then put it in the freezer. Once you have your banana in there and, um, chopped in half, You'll need a tablespoon of coconut oil. So I'm just gonna put this in there right now. And you need a tablespoon of full fat yogurt. Um, so that's something as well that you'll need. All right, now that I have everything in the blender, all you have to do is turn it on and make sure that it gets to a fine, like, Paste. You might also have to put some of the uh, materials down a little bit so then they mix up. Alright, so once you have a paste in your blender, what you want to do is take a bowl and sieve and put your mixture in there. This way you'll get all the liquids for your hair mask. All right, and then once you have it in the sieve, you're gonna mesh it down there. And then this will help take out some of the bananas that might not have blended completely. All right, so whenever I use the sieve, I got about this much out of my bowl, which is pretty good. And um, what you're going to do now, if you now you need to apply the mask. So the way that you're supposed to apply it is you want to do it from your roots to your ends. Um, I would actually recommend um, putting some of your hair up and then um, doing the mask, putting the mask on. So that's what I'm going to do. What I'm going to do is put it in a bun and let that sit for about 10 minutes. The reason why some of these ingredients have like bananas, coconut oil, and um, yogurt in it is because it's supposed to help with like moisturizing your hair. It's supposed to help with um, moisturizing your scalp too. Um, and it's supposed to promote hair growth, which is pretty cool. And that's the reason why they use these ingredients within the hair mask. So I'm going to try it out. I'm going to wait 10 minutes and then I'm going to rinse it out and shampoo my hair and see how it looks. All right, I'll see you guys soon. All right, so guys, I um, I have the, the mask out of my hair. My hair is naturally wavy. You saw it um, earlier today too. Um, without the mask, I, like, it's so nice and soft, and it does look less frizzy, which is pretty cool, so, um, I mark this as a success, because usually I can't even show the waviness of my hair, because it's just, like, it just frizzes out so badly. So, this is pretty cool. Um, I would definitely use it again. It was very easy to apply. Um, the only bad thing about it is that even with the sieve, I didn't get all of the like parts of banana out. So even like going through my hair, like I'll find like a little piece of banana that didn't mash up just enough. Um, so if you're going to use this, keep that in mind. Um, but 
Guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me this summer and watching the videos. I hope that you'll be joining me again whenever fall programming starts back up. But again, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had a good time and enjoyed the videos. Um, if there's anything that you would like to see in the future, please let us know. That's why we're here is to provide this content for you. So thank you guys so much. I hope you have a good rest of the summer. Bye.